Dangerous child sex offenders are set to be monitored for life as the state government urgently prepares to move amendments in Parliament tomorrow. Live now to state political reporter Josh Babbis for more. Josh, this comes amid the impending end of John Farden's supervision order. Yeah, Matt, this urgent move comes as Farden prepares to be released from his strict supervision order, which would essentially allow him to move freely about the community like anyone else. Now, the 69-year-old has a, a horrendous criminal history of child sex offences and repeat offences dating back to the 1960s. But under the changes that the state government's proposing by way of amendment, uh, offenders like Farden would be fitted with electronic tagging devices for the rest of their lives and be more closely monitored by police. The Attorney General says these changes will make Queensland laws the toughest in the country, but the state opposition argues that they don't go far enough and should cover repeat sexual offenders. Life means life. What does that mean? It means that the police will know where they live, where they work, what clubs they belong to any interaction with children. A plan that appears to be cobbled together, rushed, and certainly does not go far enough. Under Labor's plan, it doesn't cover all repeat violent sexual offenders. So these changes will be uh, moved by amendments that will be introduced and expected to be passed here at Parliament tomorrow. They're expected to, uh, to uh, uh, affect about 35 child sex offenders who will expire from the dangerous prisoner offenders list over the next five years. Josh Bavis, thank you.